Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2022 Panini Immaculate Baseball Hobby Edition 2 box random number block break number 1. Remember all the different disclaimers right here. Blah 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 blah. Big thanks to Ed, Harry, and Chad for getting in on this one. The next 2 box break is in the store. There are the numbers right there. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and numbers. 6 and a 6. 12 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12th and final time. Chad down to Ed. 6 and a 6, 12 times for the numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12th and final time. After 12, we got 5 down to 2. All right, so Chad with 5, 6, 7, Ed with 4. Chad with 0, 8, 9, Harry with 3. Chad with 1, Ed with 2. We're going to order these numerically. And when we come back, we're, we're going to see what font. We're going to use a, It's a new month, so we're gonna, it's going to be a serif font for December. We're going to see which font we're going to do. We're going to see if there's any trades, and, uh, and then we'll have the break. So stick around. We'll be right back. All right, welcome back, everybody. Uh, as usual, no, uh, no deals done. No deals done here. So that list right there remains the same. So for you font fans out there, we're using uh, Spectral. Spectral, that's, that's, the, that's the font that we're using. So apparently, Spectral was commissioned to be primarily used with Docs and Sheets, Google's collaborative office suite program. Designed for on-screen performance, Spectral occupies a narrow fringe of multi-purpose text typefaces that also thrive in a critical reading environment. A straightforward serif face in seven weights. Spectral aims to offer an efficient, beautiful design that works well in mainstream productivity applications. That's the font we're using for December. There you go. We've all learned something today. Thanks for the, uh, the font freaks out there. I'm going to have a podcast called Font Freaks. I'll just talk about typefaces. I'm sure someone's doing that already. All right, if you're into these uh, two box breaks, we got another two boxes in the store right now. All right, uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do this a little bit differently. All right here, so there's two boxes there, two boxes there, right? We're gonna go one, two, three, and four on the dice roll. So from left to right, one, two, three, four. If I roll a five or a six, I'll just roll again. Two, one, two. So we're doing that side, this group of two right over here. The next two box break is in the store. So go and check it out. All right, Sam is saying Wingdings is the only uh, acceptable font. Comic Sans or Bus, says Harry. Yeah, that's right, Terry. I'm a font nerd. I love it. If you could read Wingdings, Sam, that, that would be pretty amazing. Not too many who could do that. Got a redemption on the bottom, so zero. Chad, you automatically get something. Let's find out what it is. Let's get to that. We'll use the blanks out of this card to hide the hits. A little more suspense and excitement. We got Ryan McMahon, 21 out of 99. So if you're not familiar with this format, we go by that digit right there. So it goes to Chad and the number one. That's hieroglyphics. Very different from Wingdings, Harry. 
One out of 25, Ian Anderson. Three color patch. Going to the number one, that'll be for Chad. It's not gonna fit into. Slightly larger than the 130 top loader that I have. All right, that goes to Chad. And we've got Kyle Hendricks. That is 18 out of 49, so that goes to the number eight. Chad with the number eight. 1849, uh, it's the uh, California year of the California Gold Rush. How about a Mario Feliciano? 23 out of 99, it's gonna go to Harry, and the number three. Cool looking uh, shadow box autograph there. Catcher of the future, apparently. And we've got Curtis Mead. Two color patch, prospect autograph, 14 out of 44. That's going to go to Ed in the number four. Nice. And the redemption for Chad, it's going to be a clearly immaculate signature of Aaron Judge. Wow. Nice. That's a good time to uh, get Aaron Judge. Poised for a big payday, coming off an incredible regular season. Nice Aaron Judge. Uh, what's the, any Aaron Judge news today? I feel like someone would have told me in the chat if there was. No, I don't think so. But the Rays and Zach Eflin have agreed to a three-year deal, so there's that. I think that's pretty much it. I think this article about Aaron Judge was from yesterday. Yeah, it was from yesterday. We already went through that. Well, we'll see what happens. He's meeting with players. He's getting courted, I'm sure. Ooh, a button. Ooh, piece of candy. All right. The button is Dalton Jeffries. That is 9 out of 10. Chad with the number 9. Yeah, I did hear maybe the Dodgers, Dodgers may, may be making probably more active in the trade market than they would the free agency market, which might mean, yeah, maybe Willie Adamas, especially if Corbin Burns comes along with him. Trey Turner for Phillies, that could be interesting. I don't, think, I, don't, I don't think Judge turned down the Yankees, but he's been offered a pretty big deal. Ooh, big card here. Batting gloves, Gavin Sheets, 4 out of 10, Ed. That's pretty sweet. We got a ton of slider boxes available from all those HTA breaks. There you go, perfect fit right there. Probably put a couple blank cards in there so it doesn't rattle around a little bit, Ed. There you go. We got Robinson Cano, Mets edition, 62 out of 99. That'll be for Ed as well, number two. Thirteen out of twenty-five. Colton Cowser, three-color patch and autograph. I'm gonna go to Harry and the number three. I've heard that too. Trey Turner expressing a little interest, going back to the East Coast. There's Kyle Isabel, seven out of ninety-nine. That's gonna go to Chad. And as I mentioned. Previously, I'd love to see the Dodgers maybe get some of the youngsters called up and get some hungry youngsters up there. Let's let's find the next Trey Turner, you know what I mean? That kind of thing. The Dodgers have a really deep farm system. They can do it. All right, and here is 20 out of 25, Brandon Marsh, Angels edition, three-color patch, and autograph. Not sure why the Angels gave up on him 
Seeming felt a little quick. Good. He's with the Phillies now, but this goes to number zero. That'll be for Chad. There you go, gang. That's a fun, quick little break. A two-box random number block break. We just popped open a fresh case. The next two boxes in the store. I'm Joe for jazpyscasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.